I'd like to show you guys the proper way to use a tripod. Now this particular tripod is one that has um, has the uh, has a mounting plate here. So this is the mounting plate. Now on the mounting plate, you just take this your thumb here and you push over on this control right here to unlock it. Now if you can't push it for whatever reason, it's because the safety's been flipped and you can't push it. All right, so you push that back push that over the plate comes off okay so that's that's the mounting plate right there all right pretty simple uh, little device here but it mounts on the bottom of the DSLRs okay now on the bottom here is lens this way or lens that way okay well it's lens this way so we got to make sure that points to the front of the camera that's what the plate looks like okay all right I'm gonna zoom back out all right so as we're putting this on look on the bottom of the camera and you can see that someone here has done it incorrectly see this damage here along the inside of the camera here at the bottom of the camera that is from someone doing it wrong they turned the camera onto here or onto a different tripod and tore part of the bottom of the camera off not good okay so to put this on forward which this says lens that way so you turn it this way because you're trying to mount it where the camera points straight forward on the tripod not this way okay camera points that way not this way all right so we're putting this on right here as you can see all you do is you line it up with the only th only hole in the bottom of the camera thread hole Oops. put it on there put it reasonably tight it doesn't have to be extremely tight but once it starts to get slowed down and get tighter just a bit more fold that down okay all right, so now when you're putting it on the back of the, on the camera, just make sure this is fairly straight, you know, because you don't want to put it on sideways. Now, if this is all done correctly, this part right here is pushed out like that, and you put the nose first, and you push back in, and that snaps this part in. Okay, so you got to make sure once it's in there that it's on good, and you flip the safety catch, which is this thing, which is right here, this thing. Right now, it's not safe. Make sure it's in there, wiggle a little bit. That's all the way over. Flip this little switch. Now it is safe because you can't accidentally drop it off of there. All right, so that's basic mounting of a camera on a tripod, okay? Now you've got your controls, which I'm gonna go ahead and show you. Fairly simple. All right, so you've got this knob here. Loosen that and that's your tilt. All right, so we're gonna tilt down. As you can see, I'm tilting down. Getting a little reflection on the glass there, but that's tilt. I'm gonna go and I'm recording to show you what it looks like in the camera. And of course, there's there's our Texas Star, Lone Star back there. I'm gonna try. Okay, so now that we've got that, that's tilt. You just and it, if you just loosen a little bit, you get a little resistance. But you see how it moves? I'm not even touching it, and it's sliding down slowly. If you take it all the way, of course, it'll fall faster. You don't want to do that, but that gives you the idea of that. It's this is what we call fluid head. So when you're when you're tilting this time. Uh, it's nice and smooth, and when you want to pan, you loosen the handle that's down here, and then you can t pan and tilt at the same time. Now, there's Cody right there, and I'm hitting the microphone, though. Move the microphone out of the way, and there's Cody. So we're going to try pushing in on Cody here, and there's Cody. Cody, what are you doing, big guy? <whistles> Cody. Cody, are you asleep? <whistles> Cody, there he is. Hi, Cody. What's up, big guy? Here, And, of course, when you get in the position you want or you stop shooting, you always need to lock it down to make sure you're not going to mess with anything. Now, if you want to extend the, the tripod and make it taller, you can. There's a screw in front here. You loosen it, and you can raise it up like so, okay? Or lower it. And, of course, the legs can telescope, too, in the same way. So you've got lots of options. Or you can get the, I think, get the tripod up to about six feet high if you want. Okay, so that's the basics of this particular tripod and with this camera. Can you? All right. So here's one way to set up a tripod very low. You got these little snaps down here that you can push up and pull the tripod legs outward. Okay. So when you pull those tripod legs outward, you can lay them down on the ground or whatever you want to do. Okay. And it works really well to keep it much more steady because you can have it where the legs are up a little bit more. But here you're really steady. You're really steady and solid. Okay. Like right now, I've got Cody in front of me here. So I can shoot him right in front of me. I'm switching to autofocus. And 
I've got them pretty good right there. Hey, Cody. So I get a pretty low shot. Now, of course, one of the things that I like about using these tripods is this is a quick release head, okay? So right now I've got Cody pretty good. It's a little overexposed, so I'm gonna bring him down just a bit. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the camera off the tripod. So I'm gonna flip that switch we talked about, okay, and then take it off. All right, now I've got it handheld. And so I can get right down here with him. And there's Cody. Hi, Cody. I guess he's a little dark. I'm gonna open it up just a bit to, uh, and I can support it with the palm of my hand and get a nice shot of Cody over here, okay? So then I'm gonna zoom in just a bit. And the AF is set, and it looks like it's getting it pretty sharp. Mm -hmm. 